The first M1 tanks were delivered to the U.S. Army on February 28, 1980. The new tank was named for the late General Creighton W. Abrams, former Army Chief of Staff and commander of the 37th Armored Battalion. The Abrams hull and turret are built of a material similar to the ceramic and steel plate Chobham armor developed in Britain. The driver is seated in a reclining position in the front of the hull. The commander and gunner are in the turret on the right, and the loader is on the left. Armor plate separates the crew compartment from the fuel tanks and ammunition storage area. Despite its 63-ton weight, the M1A1 can attain a top speed of 45 miles per hour. The tank is 26 feet long, 12 feet wide, and 8 feet high. Range is limited to 290 miles. In March 1988, a program to develop and mount depleted uranium armor plate on the M1A1 was begun. A non-radioactive substance, depleted uranium has a density at least two and a half times greater than steel. The depleted uranium armor will raise the total weight of the Abrams tank to 65 tons, but offers vastly improved protection in the bargain.